I'm Noah Pickering. And I'm Iman Hussein. And we welcome you back to another episode of Night View, Valentine's Day edition. Weekly COVID testing is scheduled for Tuesdays and Fridays at Midtown. Have your parent complete the consent form via the shown QR code and you will be free to test weekly or as needed. Once the form is completed and signed, send it to Nurse Taylor through the email wanda.taylor at atlanta.k12.ga.us. You can find all of this information and the links on the Midtown website, as well as the most recent nightly news email. Sign up now, Knights. Did you buy more hand sanitizer, tissue, and Lysol wipes in 2020 than you'll ever use? The Midtown High School Parent Teacher Student Organization is hosting a COVID supply drive for those items. Drop off items in the counseling suite. If you don't have extra of the listed supplies but want to donate, then check your recent nightly news email for more information on how to purchase and ship COVID supplies to the school. Thank you for supporting COVID safety at Midtown. Aman, do you have a Valentine this year? Not this year, but you know who always has a date? Who? The calendar. Well, Knights, you heard it here first. Now, Night View presents a Valentine's Day. Who's most likely to? Hey, guys. I'm Iman Hussein. I'm Yusra Hassan. And I'm Janine William. And we're going to play a special game of what, Janine? Who's most likely to Valentine's Day edition? So let's see what our contestants have to say. My name is Kamari. I'm a junior, and I play basketball. Uh, my name is Jordan, I'm a junior, and I uh, skate and do photography. Hey guys, <laughs> I'm Ryan. I'm in 11th grade, and my fun fact is that my celebrity crush is Dylan O'Brien. Hi, I'm Ellery, I'm also in 11th grade, and my fun fact is I have a frog named Beans. Hi, my name is Milan Ziegler. I'm a 12th grader, and a fun fact about me is that my celebrity crush is Keith Powers, and we're married. Okay, hi, my name is Jasmine Rodriguez. I'm in 12th grade, and a fun fact about me is that my celebrity crush is Keith Powers. But he's my husband, but yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. That's him all that the way. Had to be me. That's him all the way. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't care, honestly. As you can see. She's she's a breed of a person. She doesn't care. Yeah, I don't really care. Yeah, so she doesn't. Yeah. Really. Jasmine because she because does. Because I always do very stupid <laughs> stuff, and she doesn't really think about something sometimes. Yeah, I just be doing stuff. Oh. I'm. Okay. You have to go with Jordan on this one. Kamar. Probably. I, don't, I feel like that's mean. I don't care. <laughs> Right here. If we keep it in a buck, if we keep it in a buck, really, like, no. Honest, but... I really get the most girls. Like he don't get no girls. I mean, I don't. It I... Be... <laughs> it's just what it is. <laughs> Next. Uh, I'm not the same. Me. I'm the, a Scorpio. We lie. Hell, lie. hell no. I feel like both of us. Yeah, should be honest. Yeah, like, yeah, I, I if we it. can. Definitely dies with me because he don't know how to. I ain't gonna lie, like he don't know how to I mean, keep himself I love to together. lie. Whenever it benefits me, I'm a lie. You know what I mean, okay. Do that, then yeah. She uh, likes to do pranks, and it falls back on her, and true. she needs to learn her lesson. Yeah, it's not being toxic. Oh, oh, <laughs> yeah. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you had a good laugh, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Career, Technical, and Agricultural Education, or CTAE Month, designed to support student success in CTAE fields after high school, will take place from February 1st through March 4th. On each Wednesday of the month, professionals in the field will zoom into CTAE classrooms to discuss vital career skills. On each Friday, there will be a CTAE Spirit Day. Today is CTSO T-Shirt Day. Friday, February 25th will be Future Career Day. And Friday, March 4th will be College Spirit Day. On February 23rd, Midtown will host Mock and Roll Interviews, in which participating students will be interviewed by professionals. And finally, College and Career Motivation Week will take place from February 28th through March 1st, during which school counselors will host a multitude of college and career events. Thanks to the Midtown CTAE programs and counseling department for this month of opportunity. Attention seniors, it's time to pay your senior fees. Senior fees add up to $95 and include graduation get up, a diploma covered, transcript service costs, and any other end of the year activities. Since last semester, APS has changed payment systems. The new system is called School Cash Online. If you have already paid your senior fees using the old system, know that your payment is accounted for. If you have not yet paid your senior fees, then please use the new system, scan the QR code shown to navigate to School Cash Online, and pay your fees. Please pay by February 28th. The Atlanta Board of Education and Superintendent Student Advisory Council presents Breakfast with the Board. 
On Thursday, February 4th, 2022, from 9.15 to 10.15 a.m., join your Midtown Student Advisory Delegates for a deep conversation with your board members. Selected classes have been invited to attend, but questions from all students are welcomed, as this listening session is intended to increase student voice across the district. Scan the shown QR code to submit your questions. The board asks you to remain open-minded, transparent, and enthusiastic. It's the season of love here at Midtown. Let's see some students' perspectives on love and the holiday. So the first question is, we all start soft, flowers or chocolate? I feel like flowers, I feel like flowers. Flowers. Oh, uh, you know, I like chocolate, like, cause it's sweet. What's the most important aspect in a relationship? Probably quality time. You gotta see each other. Communi I like that one. Communication, man. Communication. You gotta, you gotta know how to talk. You know, know each other's schedule and 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 really enjoy each other. You know, so communication is perfect. Yeah. Stay in or going out on Valentine's Day? Okay, so I'm an introvert. Okay. So on Valentine's Day, I gotta switch it up a little bit and go out and then go back home. Yeah, a little bit of both, like, yeah. yeah. Both. What's your perfect date on Valentine's Day? Perfect date is whatever y'all both like doing. I, I like eating. I like to eat, you know what I'm saying? And I also like the credit experience. So, you know, maybe like a little, a little, uh, what's it called? Uh, what's it called, the circle thing? The, uh, yes, you do, the ride, you go in a circle. Oh, the, the, the Ferris wheel. wheel. Again, you gotta go out, do something, and then go home and spend time with each other. Keep it a buck. I think, Don't keep it a buck. No, 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 I'm going to keep it a hundred. You asked me a question, an interview. I think the best the best thing to do on, on Valentine's Day is, you know, just enjoy each other's presence. Okay, thank you. My name is Sean Van Wheely, and this is Super Bowl Trivia. I'm Lincoln. I'm Wesley. Martavius. Dashner. Ryan. Jono. Do you guys know what the Roman numerals for this year's Super Bowl are? Uh, LVI. LVI, yeah. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> no. 49? No. Nope. No clue. What are Roman numerals? Do you know what teams are in the Super Bowl this year? Uh, Rams and Bengals. Rams and Bengals. No, uh, the Rams and uh, the Bengals. Rams and the Bengals. All right. Do you guys have any favorite players from these teams this year in the Super Bowl? Uh, Jamar Chase. Joe Shiesty. Joe Burrow. Joe Burrow. Joe Burrow. Matthew Stafford. Uh, Joe Burrow. The art department is requesting cereal and other product boxes for artistic reuse. However, they ask that regular cardboard boxes not be donated. Please bring donations to room E115. Thanks for supporting Art at Midtown. The Midtown Math Club is holding a book drive for new and used AP, SAT, and ACT study books. Drop off books to Ms. Robinson in room C405. Donate today to help a fellow knight. If you are great at math, you should sign up to be a tutor. Shifts are available Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays between 4 and 5 p.m. in room C304. Scan the shown QR code to sign up for a shift. And remember, if you need help with math, the Math Center is open to you for assistance on the given weekdays. Hey seniors, it's scholarship season, and the CCC is here to help you with your essay writing. Whether you're having trouble starting or just want some extra commentary before you submit, you're welcome to request assistance by the way of email address cccsahelp at gmail.com. Again, that's cccsahelp at gmail.com. Best of luck in the admissions process. Are you searching for scholarships? Let's go to Lila Bransford with more. Hi, I'm Lila Bransford with your scholarship opportunities this week. Attention seniors, the Boys High School Scholarship is an opportunity to earn money towards college, open only to Midtown students. The eligibility requirements include being a Midtown High School senior, a minimum GPA of a 3.0, and demonstrate commitment to community service. Scan the QR code for more information. The scholarship awards up to $5,000 annually for up to four years, and the deadline is February 15th. The Achieve Atlanta Scholarship is open to student applications now. This is a need-based award designed to support APS students pursuing various post-secondary paths after high school. Students eligible for the four-year scholarship will be awarded $5,000 per year. Renewable for four years, and the students eligible for the two-year or technical program will receive $1,500 per year. Note that you must complete the FAFSA to apply for Achieve Atlanta. The deadline to apply is May 31st. Scan the QR code for more information and to apply for the scholarship. The Community Foundation of Greater Atlanta provides numerous scholarships. Open now for the application. The deadline is February 15th at 11.59 p.m. Scan the shown QR code to learn more about these and to apply for these scholarships. Best of luck to our seniors in their college journeys. If you have questions on accessing more money for college, about the Hope and Zell Miller scholarships, 
Regarding the practicality of student loans for your situation, submitting the FAFSA about whether college is the right option for you based on your financial costs or about available options ranging from work study to scholarships. Then you may want to attend the College Financial Aid Information Night presented by Midtown High School's Guidance Department and the Georgia Student Aid Finance Commission. Parents and students alike are invited to this event on Wednesday, February 16th at 6 p.m. It will take place virtually, so scan the QR code to access the Zoom link or review the meeting ID and passcode shown on the screen. We'll see you there nights. Midtown encourages all parents and students to complete the survey linked in the shown QR code to receive valuable information throughout the school year from the Guidance Counseling and College Advising Department. Simply enter your and your parents' information to be kept in the loop. The weekend is just around the corner nights. So let's go to Nisha Ball with your weekend weather report. Hello Midtown Knights, I'm Nisha Ball and I'm here with your weekend weather report. According to the Weather Channel, on Saturday we'll see a high of 64 degrees and a low of 33 degrees, and on Sunday we'll see a high of 48 degrees with a low of 27 degrees Fahrenheit. Have a great weekend. Current Midtown High School students who are on winter sports team now, were on a fall sports team this year, or were on a spring sports team last year are eligible to sign up for strength and conditioning workouts, which will continue to take place throughout the year. These workout sessions are completely free. Scan the shown QR code to sign up now. Contact Athletic Director Patrick Johnson at patrick.johnson at atlanta.k12.ga.us if you have additional questions. As we inch toward the end of the year, Midtown sports teams are digging deeper into their seasons. Let's go to Finn with this week's Sports Splash. I'm Finn Estella and welcome to Sports Splash, Episode 9. Individual preseason awards have been announced to the girls soccer players at Midtown. Junior Shea Bowman is the reigning 6A Player of the Year, and Senior Callum Cucci, as well as Junior Archer Strittleman, were named first team all-region in 2021. Last Friday, both varsity soccer teams came out with wins in tough games against Decatur, with the boys winning 3-2 and the girls winning 2-1. This past Tuesday, however, both teams lost to McIntosh, with the girls losing 2-0 and the boys losing 3-1. Tonight, they'll play against Maris and next Tuesday against Paideia, both at Midtown. The Midtown basketball season is coming to an end. They're ending the season off with a high note, with both the varsity girls and boys coming out with a dub against North Springs this past Tuesday, with the boys winning 69-57 and the girls winning 54-21. Check out these highlights. They both played their last home games this Friday against Chapel Hill High School. Varsity Baseball will be starting the season next week by playing Lakeside on Monday and Charles Drew on Tuesday, both games being at Walden Athletic Complex. Midtown Boys and Girls Varsity Tennis will play next Tuesday against Westminster at Westminster. In lacrosse news, teams have been finalized and games have started, with the boys varsity team having played against Pace last night and the girls varsity playing against East Paulding tonight. Boys varsity will also be playing at Union Grove next Monday at Walden and North Springs next Wednesday. That's all for this week, Knights. Don't forget that Midtown students will have no school spanning from Thursday, February 17th to Monday, February 21st, returning on Tuesday, February 22nd with an A-Day. So if you're missing your weekly Night View fix next Friday, find us at the Night View channel on YouTube and subscribe to keep up with new episodes or revisit the ones you missed. Stay safe and have a great weekend.